who made these carrots. Must be a trail marker. Let's keep an eye out for them. Some ruins up ahead. Wait here. I'll go take a look. Oh, Victor. Still do a lot of traveling these days? Yeah, I try. I tend to pick jobs that get me away from the computer. <laughs> yeah, I was telling Nathan it's shocking how much of the business has moved to the internet. I mean, I bet you have all sorts of options to go to Hot Cargo now. Yeah, sure, but I prefer talking to clients face to face. Get a good read on them. Hard to do that in a chat room talking to some guy named Antiquity Master 37. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. <coughs> huh. Not much to see here. Well, ah, nothing worthwhile. Come on, let's keep going. Hey, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest four by four. Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time again. That bridge there is what you would call rickety. Uh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go. Made it. Okay, kid. Don't drop us. I just keep it slow, keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going on right now. It's gonna be fine. <laughs> We're good. Everything's good. Jesus Christ. Onward and upward. I'm getting nowhere fast. in the hang of this. Easy. There we go. <laughs> no, turn into it. <clears throat> oh, Jesus. Oh, my spine. Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. Hey, look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy about? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 four four with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. We're going off-road. It might rain, might be muddy. How about we go through this whole goddamn thing and never use that winch? All right, hang on tight. Oh, oh, gee. Shit.
Take this slow, kid. Yeah. So, Nathan, you're thinking Avery, Two, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because... why exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? British authorities were closing in on him. Sure. Maybe, uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. Valiant effort. Let's go check out that tower. I'll come with. It's in pretty good shape for something several hundred years old. Yeah. They're definitely ruins from Avery's era. <sighs> Sam, look. That's. Christopher Condon's sigil is uh, captain of the Fiery Dragon, operated out of Madagascar around Avery's time. So maybe Avery recruits pirate captains to what be his lookouts? That don't make any sense. No, it doesn't. Well, maybe each captain was responsible for a tower, along with providing the men for it. Whatever the case, this certainly isn't our final stop on our tour. Got some big plans for this winch. than it looks. All right, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. <laughs> See, Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We cleared a hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, not yet. Small victory. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine, you've come here. A well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. <laughs> oh, poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, it could do a lot worse than here. It's taking forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor, patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Sam. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a former squid. But the point is, we got it pretty easy. Yeah, well, still, oh shit, stop, stop! Sam. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. That's the wrong one, right? That's the good news. That means it's bad news. 
The only route to the volcano is straight to them. Oh, shit. We do have the drop on. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead. Faces. You all know what to do. We'll serve them right, too. Just hope my bag is first. <laughs> Your shaky hands couldn't do anything till they get in bludgeoning to Why I imagine that? <sighs> All right then. He's on your left. Hang on. Movement over there. Watch yourself. <gasps> How's it? You got anything? Talk to me, man. You've got a bad feeling here. <gasps> How's it? We have that dungus hooked up yet? We're all set up. Just waiting on approval from Nadine to blow it. Good. Place looks empty. I'd like to get it over with and move on. Interesting. Hey, you there?
Okay, I think that's it. God damn it, Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. I mean, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. Looks like that bridge leads back to the trail.
Jesus, these pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now how do we get out of here? One down, one to go. Again with the winch, Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. <clears throat> Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than Rafe? No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money-up-front kind of mercenary. So Rafe's got the advantage there. Uh, one sec. Happy hunting. <clears throat> uh. Ready to go. Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. He's thinking the same damn thing. What if they found the treasure already? Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Hey, Sam, you don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading. Hey, is that a well? Well, well, well. <laughs> Get it? You know, because it's a well. Sully, you stole your joke. I noticed. Good sense of humor, though. <laughs> what have we here? Damn, these pirates weren't messing around.
Did you find something down there? Maybe. Do me a favor, get behind the wheel for a sec. Will do. Hey, Sully, throw the car in reverse. Okay, give me a second. Okay, what do we have here? So? Nothing major. I'll show you back at the hotel. Sorry, you were saying? Um, oh, right. Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was just one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know? Sure. Well, you know, besides books, push-ups, Smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs. Uh, ah, hell. See that smoke? Oh, shoreline, slow down. Sam, you were saying? No, that's right, I was. Uh, anyway, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs. It's a whole lot of thinking. It's pretty much it. For shoreline, idiots. I think we're clear.
Sam, you were saying? Oh, that's right, I was. Uh, anyway, that's pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. Check it out, boys. What is it? probably see all of King's Bay from up here. Yeah. Hey, look. There's the city. And there's the river valley. Hey, guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? I can't tell. <laughs> so... How are you doing? Yeah, still in one piece. I appreciate you coming along for the ride. And especially for negotiating with that rental guy. <laughs> no problem. Hell, I'd be lying if I said I wasn't enjoying myself. <laughs> Me too. I'll let you look at this. Quite the view. I just keep waiting to wake up and find myself in solitary or something. <laughs> it's all some kind of dream. Sam. No, no, no guilt trip. I'm just... Let's go find this thing. You bet. Got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Drawbridge? How medieval. Yeah. Well, you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to keep people out. Or protect something inside. <laughs> huh. Another sigil. So, do you recognize this one? I do, actually. And Bonnie. Mm -hmm. Operated out of the Caribbean. I thought she died in jail. At least that's what the stories tell us. <laughs> right. Avery must have invited her too. Check out that drawbridge. Sounds good. Hey, be careful, kid. All right, I'll see if there's something up here. Ugh. <sighs> 
Welcome. Hey, guys. There's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Bingo. Sam! Special delivery! Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey, kid. You all right? I'm fine. You all right? Yeah. You got this? Mm-hmm. I seen a few. I'll bring the car closer. Dude, just relax. I got this. I mean, there's only one crank, you know? <laughs> Keep up the good work, kid.
Shit! I see them! Ah! Crap! <laughs> Get that bridge down. Try that again. Big tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? You know, not to nitpick, but Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? Take a look around. So just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh, half. Half of what? Well, he only knows about the Gunsway heist. Which is worth 400 million. <clears throat> right, but if Nathan's theory is correct, then there's a lot more treasure. So you should have told him it was 200,000. You never tell your partners how much the job is really worth. I wasn't exactly expecting to be partners with him. Guys. We're gonna find it, pay off that lunatic, and still have plenty to spare. Trust me. We're all set. Here we go. Sharing this one with my shrink. <laughs> Wait, you have a shrink? No, but I will after this. Come on, you guys are overreacting. Get the whole thing under control. <laughs> that 
Hold on to something. Ah. Ah, that was a nice change of pace. Yeah, I'm almost disappointed. Uh, almost. Now, let's find our way in. Let's go claim our treasure, boys. <laughs> 